The proposal for the Mezzo apartment building just off White Avenue near the old Strathcona post office is unusual. It's unsettling, but it's also essential for old Strathcona to this project go ahead. City Council will be deciding on Monday about the project. And suffice to say, not every councillor is as positive as I am about it. I talked to Ben Henderson, who represents that area. He's dead set against it. He is arguing that the project is going to upset, harm the ambiance of White Avenue. That it's not gonna be the same on the street. This area would have been developed like every other area in the 1970s and 60s, but it was so run down that it was left. That means we have this great inventory of 1910, 1920 buildings there that everybody loves. I love it too. So the councillor is saying, you built this 16-story building right beside uh, White Avenue. It's just going to change the whole area. It's not going to be the same. It's going to ruin it, he says, and we'll never get it back. So pretty dramatic uh, rhetoric there. I don't agree with them, though. There's lots of reasons to go ahead with this project. White, right now, White Avenue is full some of the time, but not all of the time. It needs people, it needs customers. It's in competition with a rising downtown with 124th. It's got to have this injection. These people, uh, most of all though, this building is a block off White Avenue. Yes, it's 16 uh, stories tall, but you're not going to notice it at all when you're on White Avenue. The shadow won't be casting down on the street. Um, it's built on a podium. When you're on 104th Street downtown by those podiums, you don't notice the towers in behind. You just see the podium and the nice little shops, uh, coffee shops and restaurants in the front of the podium. That's what this is going to have. It's also going to be built in the style of the old Scona building, of the old Scona uh, post office. So it's going to blend right in that podium. It's going to have 229 units, 10% of them for families. The rest of them are small apartments for first time apartment buyers or, or seniors. It's going to bring in two, three hundred people, about a hundred kids to that area. White Avenue needs more uh, eyes on the street, needs more customers, and for everyone else it's going to just be more people means better people watching on the avenue. Thumbs up to the project, I hope it goes ahead.